Well, dozens of dog breeds are on display at the pet pavilions at the State Fair. Our Shane Wells is bringing us all the furry four-legged friends this morning. Coming to you from one of my favorite zones, the Pet Pavilion in the North End, Twin Cities Area Shih Tzu Club. We have April McGuire. Okay, who do you have here? So this is Lotto. She actually just finished her championship um, at the beginning of August, and it is confirmed with AKC. Um, so I thought I would do her up in a full show um, bow and show her long hair for everybody. I love the sign. It says not just a pretty face. Yeah, so what, what else is to the breed? So Benji over there, that Jan is holding. Um, he does fast cat. Um, we do agility, obedience, um, barn hunt. They can do it all. It's just not a pretty face. What do you love about Shih Tzus? Their temperament. They are just such sweet dogs. And um, the other thing that I like about them is they have some bone. So they're not just, um, you know, like a, a tiny dog, but they're sturdy. So solid. I love solid, it. Yes. Okay. And they love people. So look at that face. Yeah. Love it. Thank you. You're I appreciate welcome. it. And right next to the tiny pups, we got a big girl. Who is this? Okay. Karen Johnson. First of all, I want to introduce you. Bernice Mountain Dog Club. Who do you have here? This is Nina. She is an 18-month-old Bernice Mountain Dog, and I have to brag about her just for a second. Yeah, this is your time. She, she just became an AKC champion over the weekend. Wow. She went to a big dog show at, at the Washington County Fairgrounds, and um, so today she's at the State Fair. Has she stayed humble with all this success? Um, so far, so good. <laughs> so we're not going to buy her a crown yet or anything, because then it may go all to her head. <laughs> What's it like being at the State Fair with the dogs, and why is it important to kind of let people learn more? about the breed we're here to educate and help people understand um, you know why we breed purebred dogs and that you are actually you breed for certain characteristics in your dogs and it's really a lot of fun you meet all kinds of people thank you Karen I appreciate it good work and congratulations to you <laughs> thank you <laughs> next up the American Eskimos and you got four here Mary Verness you brought the dogs these are all yours they're all mine they're all grand champions or champions uh, they're all related to each other they're the standard variety and we hang out at Twin City Obedience not very far from the club, uh, from the fair at all. What do they think about this, being at the fair? This is a big deal. So look at Sophia. She comes into this booth, and she puts her back to the edge, and she's going, people pet me. I love being petted. Bella, Sophia. Oh, she looked at you. She knew. And what do you love about this breed? Their activity level. Okay. They, I love, they're very active. They're very empathetic, um, <laughs> lively. <laughs> um, they do shed, and they will let people know when people show up to my house, and I want that. I don't want an attack dog, but I will definitely know if somebody shows up to the house. So. Well, thank you for letting us uh, check out your pups and show them off a little bit. That's what they're all here for, right? Yeah, enjoy the fair. It's having a great time at the fair here. Thank, thank you, Mary. We appreciate it. Beyond petting lots of sweet pups, you can also take in some live agility demos. There's surgeries that are happening and also a little shopping zone with lots of vendors to check out. Again, we're at the Pet Pavilion in the North End. Back to you.